eight albums in, man, and we ain't we ain't slowing down for nothing. Nothing, you know what I mean? We are gonna keep it going, man, for real. Feels good. Right. Uh, feels um, you know like a breath of fresh air, man. It's like whew, wiping the sweat off, like man, you know what I mean? Because we've always set out to do this, you know what I mean? We always wanted our own label, you know, have the um, <clears throat> have the outlets to you know put out our music as well as you know do an artist or other artists. So um, yeah, we I mean, it feels excellent, man. I mean, the energy has been incredible, man. Like, he's excited. You know what I mean? And um, we just, I mean, everybody's just kind of feeding off each other. You know what I mean? Right. We all, all, the vibe has been good. Great energy, man. We go in and he might have three different beats going on at one time, man. And we, from one room to the next, you know what I mean? And just, you know, creating. And um, I mean, it's just, the energy has been excellent. He's been yeah. to the majority of all our interviews. You know what I mean? Like, like he's actually the fifth member, <laughs> a part of the group. And um, it, it's just been fun, man. It's just been fun. We, 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 we didn't say it either. We didn't say it either. That was brand new too, brother. <laughs> but, it, but, but, but it was humbling. It was humbling. And, Very um, much so. You know what I'm saying? Like, over the years, I mean, we all, everybody makes mistakes. You know what I mean? And, you know, everybody's not going to have a perfect run. But, um, I mean, it was just good to hear, you know what I'm saying, to hear him acknowledge that. You know what I mean? And we, I mean, we're grateful for that. Team. Team. Which is team. team. Right. The like, team got to be dope. And that's something we, you know, as far as the, the, the comments Jermaine made, about being arrogant and having that that played a part in some decisions. I I know the for a fact it did with us as well, right. because we underestimated the you know the part that the team plays and how important they are in terms right. of moving the whole product. Right. Exactly. Because we, we always felt don't. like we so right. We always <laughs> felt like we so talented. Like excuse my up. French, but f him or f them because yeah. right. we gonna do this regardless. But the older you get, you understand that even if you are Michael Jordan, right. Right. Michael Jordan yeah. still got to have that team. Got you know you. what I mean? Yes. So, and and we like I said, our arrogance made us take that for granted a little bit back yeah. in the day. You know, boom. Yeah. Oh yeah. I think it's as good, if not better. better. One thing people don't understand about us and Brian is that, by definition of producer, we produce as much as Brian does right. because we those. It's about where the ideas originate from. Right. And nine times out of ten, we, we lead him places and he'll lead us right. places. Yeah. You know what I mean? So with us, that chemistry's always been easy because we get in a room. We one full thing, of ideas. Right. Man. I was saying one thing about me and my brother. We never walk into a studio without one. We already know, like, it's five it's, different things we could do soon we get in there. Right. You know what I mean? Right. Right. So it's just about who going to help us get to that fastest and the dopest. You know what I mean? Like, right. That's what it is. And, and Brian Michael Cox, he's a, you know what I mean? Like, he's... We call him the Geek Squad. I mean, basically, he come in the studio every three days with a new gadget, a new beat machine, and something. But, he, you know but I mean? he's super talented. And, 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 he's, and, and he's super talented. I mean, since day one, since day one working with him. All right. Uh, I mean, it was good. I mean, at the end of the day, we just went out and, and, and recorded the record. Um, man, back in the day, we used to bring Jazzy Faye food, man, to the studio. Like, literally, before, exactly. he added, before he got his publishing deal and all this. I'm going to tell you something about that record, table. though. But Jazzy, that Jazzy record, family. Right. That record... <clears throat> We did a record with Biggie, that record, and we did a record with Pop. Both records Jazzy Faye did. Mm -hmm. yep. Now, you got to ask Demet on the label side why they wouldn't clear that Pop record the back Pop in the day. I don't know. <laughs> Yo, they wouldn't like clear that one, though. But they, but they did clear the Biggie one. Yeah, and, they did. You know what I mean? They did. It ended up being a good, you know, a good thing for it. Yes, Jazzy Faye. Ask Jazzy Faye. You got it. He's my Jazzy Faye. Probably still got it. I'm telling you. Yeah, you got to yeah, do it. Uh, good answer. <laughs> Yo, this Jagged Edge. We rock with Hip Hop DX, baby. So yeah. we do a lot, all right? Yeah. So we do.